All right, Pyros, welcome to Captain Rob 73 Pyro Headquarters once again. Probably got our last stash update. Um, this is the first part of it. I got like five more kegs coming this afternoon. I have to, had to wait for them to get delivered, go pick them up. But uh, we're going to get the beginning part of it done here. Got a little, it's mostly cakes. Picked up a bunch of 500 gram cakes, a couple smaller ones. But uh, we got three swimming with the fishes, a fat head, three of those. We got a mean monkey, make it rain. It's a great cake, had it last year. Got this campaign trail by Fathead. This thing rocks. I've seen that demo. Got party time down here by Leopard. I've seen, seen all these as a demo. It's Cataclysm, had one of those last year. Great cake. Spot the Diff, Magnus brand. And we got, oh, we got an Underworld. We got a Ledoux cakes this year. These cakes are all good. The uh, five more cakes I have coming this afternoon are all Ledoux cakes. Then we got this Catastrophic. Got this uh, Foul Fireworks Fire Goddess. It's a great little fan cake. Got this Legends Firework. Keep calm and God bless America. That's awesome. We got Eagle King by Leopard. Nice fan cake. Then we got two Ledoux we'll cakes here. They're, they're Reckoning. I really like these cakes. I had to wait and wait for them to get in stock at my local firework place, but they finally got them. So, awesome. And also, like all these cakes I got here, bought these on a group buy with a few other people. Most of these came in a case of four, four in each case. Some of them were a little bit different, so we split them up a little differently. But, uh, you know, we all chipped in and went to a wholesaler and bought a bunch of cases. But I bought a case of the Reckoning just for myself. But also, one of the guys wanted some mortar shells, so we bought a case of uh, of Mean Monkey Zeus shells. So we split that up four ways, so I got a, another 24-pack of those. Which can never turn those down, they're so good. And also, stopped at, stopped at little local places here, picking up stuff. I got more little torches for the girls. Got more Pure Fantasy Fountains, my favorite fountain slash cake, whatever you want to call it. Got some other miscellaneous fountains. Got this, uh, I think this is a Great Grizzly Jumble Red Star. I already took the label off to put on my wall, so that's why I got it written on there. And the wife stopped at uh, Dollar Tree, and I think she bought all their little short stack fountains that I like. I think there's, I don't know, 14 of them there or something. And I got a brick of black cats for my uh, firecracker collection. Got a fantasy whip. Those are cool. Got some little, little tiny fountains here for my nephews to light off then got one of these uh you know 16 shot small cakes you, i think you guys know what these are there's no name brand and it's heavy i think you know what those do and uh also i started loading up all my mortar racks well not at least isn't all of them but i've started loading them and fusing them here they kind of are in the corner here and uh today i'm going to start setting up all my cake boards and fusing them together just kind of waiting to get my uh, last four or five cakes, whatever it is. But I'll be posting some videos once I get this stuff all fused up and ready to go. We'll do a little quick stand of the rest of the stash over here. Got a lot of stuff to get ready this year. All kinds of stuff. And we got our normal stuff up here. Anyways, here goes a little stash update. Like I said I'm gonna cut into this with the other five here this afternoon. All right, we're back. We got it. It is about ten hours later. We finally got our our second delivery of our Lydu cakes. We got three vixens. We got our torment cake. Let's skip these for a second. We got our frenzy. These are all wide you cakes, great cakes. And I also uh, did a little trading. Guy bought a couple cases of these. Traded a couple of my other, my one of a Pyro uh, Pyro Academy cake and a Bullet Storm for these four. And also gave me a box of these uh, Legend brand Whistling Artillery shells. These things are sweet. 
I mean, for what they are. I mean, they're cheapy artillery shells, but they're they're good. But these are going to be going on my boards, and we're going to take a quick little jaunt outside of the pyro headquarters, and I'm going to show you what I got going on with my cake boards so far. That's it. Try not to get sick here. We're going out in the, the main garage area. So here I got two four by eight pallets, more or less. And this is where we'll scan from one side to the other. Hold on a second, buddy. I'm making a video here. My one of my uh, minion nephews showed up. Helps me with my fireworks. He's behind me, so you hear him talking. But uh, the process of getting all these cakes wired up or fused up. But these are a lot of the ones you've seen in my other update videos. And I kind of got these boards sort of mirror image in each other. Over here on the side, we're we're gonna these boards are gonna shoot kind of in tandem. We're gonna go with a reckoning, then we're going to hell yeah, then governor, then that's the fire in the whole cake. That's the label came the wrapper came completely off of it when I cut into it to do the fusing. And we got a cataclysm, then we got a stress buster. Now I got the same exact cakes all the way down here on the end. The only difference is Instead of the cataclysm, or yeah, instead of the cataclysm, I've got to make it rain. But it's still going to do the same thing. We're going to reckoning, hell yeah, governor, fire in the hole, make it rain. Then we're here to the stress buster. And also, I've got these cakes are all just sitting here. They're kind of cut up because I've cut into them to do the fusing. They're not even glued down yet. They're um, and also we got a. You gotta keep calm and God bless. We got you can just read the names on them. All these cakes, they're they're gonna go one at a time. Then down the end, the other end, I've got an Eagle King, and that is a uh, this one's a campaign trail. It's, again, when I took the label off of it, it just the whole damn thing came apart. Just the labels. I mean, the the cakes still sound, but um, those are gonna kind of shoot individually. Then in the middle here, I have them actually split because I'm, I'm going to carry these boards outside individually but I'm going to be put back together and I'm going to tie these fuses up but I got six bullet storms those are all going to go at the same time and I got six pyro academies those are going to go at the same time and we got three captain chaoses and I have two of them angled on some little platforms then we got three swimming with the fishes. Those are the same way. They're going to shoot off uh, two on an angled board and one in the middle. And then um, I got what I got to move some of this stuff around that's not glued down yet. Fit in the Vixens and the uh, Torment and the other cakes we just seen in the other room. And then we're switching up here to the front. I've got a few fan cakes. It's going to be like a uh, pre finale or a faults finale. I got pay dirt. Got a uh, death race. Then we got another pay dirt. Those are going to shoot simultaneously. I'm going to like try to fake people out, make it think it, that that is my um, finale, which in, it's not going to be my finale. The, the pallet you see sitting up here in the back, I got to put a four by eight sheet of OSB on that. I'm going to mount my couple hundred, um, couple hundred racks worth of mortar tubes on there, which uh, I think I scanned over them in the other room. Uh, some of them aren't even loaded up yet, but uh, it's a kind of, I think we got about 150 canister shells and then maybe over a hundred um, inch and a half ball shells. Some of them are pretty juicy. So uh, that that's going to be the actual finale, but I haven't even got, haven't even got that one more or less built yet. But um, I do have a 12Q firing system and this is going to be broken down into probably only like 10 Qs the way I'm fusing things. But uh, there's a little update on what we got going on here, getting things ready to go. I know my cakes look like crap now because I've cut the labels off half of them. I've cut into them to fuse it front to back, and you know, you know how things get this time of year. Anyways, Captain Rob out.